So my name's Heather Stewart um, and I'm the course leader for the BSc Honours Physiotherapy. We get a range of different applicants. We have small numbers on the, co um, on the course, so um, we have a cohort of around 26 each year. Um, we get a range of applicants from school leavers who've done A-levels or BTEC um, sports subjects, um, as well as some mature students who are looking for a change of career. Um, I think most students who come into physiotherapy as a course have an understanding of what it is as a career um, and it, it does very much lead to a career pathway into physiotherapy. The majority of our graduates go to work within the NHS, um, so that could be a range of different settings, um, either in a, an NHS trust hospital um, or in a community setting, so where they go and work around patients' homes, um, seeing the clients in their own homes or in some smaller sort of rehab centres. Um, they go across the country, they don't just tend to stay within the North West. Um, other opportunities are for students to go into private practice. Um, so we've had some graduates who have gone and worked in a, an established private practice and others who have set up their own private practice and see their own clients in their private practice. Students also have opportunities to go and work abroad, so um, some of our graduates now work in Australia, America, um, other areas of the world, um, and that's something that's an opportunity to, for a physiotherapy graduate. In terms of um, postgraduate study, um, there are opportunities to do masters, PhD, um, all the sort of postgraduate study that any other student would be able to access. Because we have a very small cohort of students, I think the students get a lot of opportunities that perhaps wouldn't be available for students on bigger physiotherapy programmes. Um, in the second year, the students spend some time um, planning a teaching session for local primary school children um, and they go out into those primary schools and teach a class on a subject that the school have chosen related to health. Um, we also, in the third year, organise uh, the students a mock interview within their um, one of the local trusts so they get invited for an interview they take their portfolio um, and go as if they were going for a, a proper interview um, and they get feedback on their performance by the clinicians who've interviewed them so that's a really good opportunity for them to test the water and see how they need to improve in terms of going for those first interviews for jobs after graduation as part of the programme, the students undertake a lot of clinical practice, so there are five um, assessed placements in the programme, and again, that gives them experience of doing the job, which is obviously vital in terms of graduation and employment. Within our division, um, we have two professors. Uh, we have a professor of biomechanics, and we have a professor of physiotherapy. As well as that, we have quite a lot of researchers within the department. Um, and students are able to work as interns over the summer period with those professors um, undertaking research in our biomechanics laboratory, movement analysis laboratory, as well as other um, internships that are available. And they change each year, so it depends on what subjects the, the researchers are investigating at that time and um, what the internship opportunities are. We've also got opportunities for students to um, undertake internships abroad as well. So um, we're currently advertising for some students to go to Zambia um, as part of an internship over the summer. I think our biggest unique selling point is the fact that we do have such a small cohort of students. So we take around 26 UK-based students and then around sort of three or four international students each year. What that means is that the students get to know each other very, very well as part of the, the cohort, but it also means they get to know us very well. I think we're a very friendly course team um, and we have a very open door policy and the students treat us like family rather than like tutors. Um, I think because of the small cohort size as well, there are lots of opportunities for them to do things that perhaps don't get provided at other physiotherapy programmes in the country. So as I've mentioned before, the school experience, they also go off to SPACE, which is a, a local um, centre for um, children with disabilities um, where they can use the sensory rooms there. And our students get to go and experience that. They also um, 
get to do their mock interviews in the third year and um, I think there's lots of other things, small things within the cohort that means that it um, makes it a bit different from other physiotherapy programmes in the country. So if anybody wants any further information or has any questions about the programme that they would like answered, they can either email me directly or they can go to the website.